Hello, my dear student. Today we are going to have a new lesson, third intermediate, upstream three, unit seven. Lesson 7D, restaurants. Objectives, to identify the elements of a restaurant advert, to design a restaurant advert, to classify food items in a menu, to write questions and sentences ordering food in a restaurant. Let's start. Here, you have an advert of an restaurant. We want to go through it to find out elements of a restaurant advert. We will start. We have the name of the restaurant, Taste of India, place, it's in Rochester, the speciality, What's this restaurant is special in which type of food? For example, Indian food, service, atmosphere, the place you describe about the, the place, the atmosphere of the place. As for example here, it's written relaxed atmosphere. Opening hours. These are the elements. As we say, these are the elements of a restaurant advert. Name, place, speciality, service, atmosphere, opening, hours. Task 1. Look at the adverts A and B on the next slide. Then complete the table. Here you have two adverts. Advert A, advert B. These are the two adverts, advert A and advert B. Now, as you can see, you have a table here. We will go through them and to find out which place is going to have, for example, these items. For example, you have advert A, the place is Peter's, advert B, the restaurant is Bull's Head. Which one is specializes in one kind of meat? Which one is open six days a week? Which one have performances by musicians? Which one has a relaxed atmosphere? And the last point will provide food for a party at your home. I'll give you three minutes to go through the adverts and find and go through the table and find which advert for which point.
Now, my dear students, let's check your answers. Yes, for advert B specializes in one kind of meat. And also, the uh, restaurant is open six days a week. As you can see, restaurant A, they have the performances by musicians. And also, they have, or the restaurant has a relaxed atmosphere. And the last point, will provide food for a party at your home. So these are about the two adverts, which one Peter's and the bull's head. Let's go on with our lesson. Task two. Design your own restaurant advert. Remember, start with capitals, use the correct tense, spell correctly, and end with full stops. Here are the questions you can answer to help you to design your own restaurant advert. Let's go through the questions together. What is the name of the restaurant? Where is it in the world? What does it specialize in? What time does it open and close? What is the atmosphere like? What is the service like? These are the questions may help you to design your own advert. I can go back for you and you can see these adverts as two models that you can design your adverts as these two. These are the questions or the things or elements you should have in your advert. I'll give you five minutes to design your own restaurant advert.
Now, my dear students, let's check your answers. Or we will have models of these uh, questions, answers. You can have it as an example. For example, what's the name of the restaurant? I want my restaurant. The name of the restaurant is Fantasy. Where is it? It's in the center of Manama. And what does it specialize in? In Bahraini traditional food. You can choose whatever you want. What time does it open? I chose. It opens 7 a.m. and closes at 1 a.m. What is the atmosphere like? It has cozy, comfortable atmosphere. And last one, what is the service like? The service is wonderful. This is what to follow when you want to design your own advert. Task three, ordering a meal. Now we started from thinking about our own restaurant, then we designed our advert, then now we will go to ordering a meal. What does a restaurant menu contain? Starters, for example, salad, soup, and we have cheese balls. Main course, rice with chicken, meat with rice, pasta. Drinks, juice, tea or coffee, soft drink. These are the main elements or main parts in a menu when you want now to design your own menu for your restaurant. And also the last thing which all of us we like the most, the dessert. Cakes, for example, ice cream, fruit salads. Task four. Here you have different types or examples of the parts of a menu. We want to match. I'll give you three minutes to match examples for each part or section in a menu. Try to go through them, then match them to the right part in a menu. I'll give you three minutes to do this.
Now, my dear students, let's check your answers. What's the name of our restaurant here? The Teen Canteen. Our menu, the starter, we have the lentil soup. And also, don't forget to put the prices. Mushroom soup. Excellent. The grilled chicken is the main course. We have vegetables pasta. For the desserts, we have ice cream scoop, strawberry cheesecake, and last thing, we have drinks, for example, water bottle. Of course, your, your menu sh should have more than this, but these are just examples. After now, you designed your advert. Now you put your menu. Let's go on with our lesson. And also, we have fresh fruit juice. Task five. Here you have a dialogue. Read the dialogue, then put tick or across to the right place. You have a dialogue between waiter. Waiter is a person who works in a restaurant and Ahmed who's, the, who's there in the restaurant. There is a dialogue between them. I'll give you three minutes to go through the dialogue and find out if these statements wrong or sorry, false or true. The sentences are, Ahmed would like cheese balls for the starter. Two, Maryam ordered great salad. Three, Ahmed would like grilled chicken for the main course. Four, Maryam would like some water. Now go through the dialogue and find the answers. Now, my dear students, check your answers.
I hope that you have them all right. This is one example, how to be in a restaurant and how the dialogue, how we are going, the conversation will be between a waiter and the customer. Let's go on. How to order a meal. To take someone's order, what would you like for the starter? For example, the customers will reply, I would like cheese balls, please. And also, I can say, I'd like. As I showed you before in the previous dialogue, we have other examples. For example, I'll have a Caesar salad. This is the abbreviation of I will have. This dialogue, a kind of examples, how the conversation between a waiter and the customer. After we have the examples, we will go on with our lesson. Here, the task, imagine now you are having dinner in a restaurant. Complete the following dialogue. You have a dialogue between a waiter and you. I'll give you here time to read it from the beginning and try to complete the dialogue. Now, my dear students, I'll show you a model how the dialogue will be when you finish your dialogue. Waiter, would you like? What would you like for your starter? I would like mushroom soup. What would you like for the main course? I would like vegetables pasta. What would you like for the dessert? I would like strawberry cake. These are examples. You can change them, of, of course. My dear students, this is the last task in our lesson. I hope that you enjoyed the lesson today and see you next lesson.